Next tonight, making the East Midlands a safer place. A new alert system for major incidents and terrorist attacks is being set up across the region. Well, dozens of businesses have signed up to a police scheme that was actually designed for the London Olympics. Our social affairs correspondent, Jeremy Ball, reports. Making the Olympics so successful involved a huge security operation and behind it a vast communication network to distinguish rumours from genuine threats. Information comes in. Now that alert system called CSSC is coming to the East Midlands. This law firm in Nottingham is one of the first to sign up. Every business has got to think about the threat of terrorism, what plans they need. You don't want to send them out of the building when they're actually safer inside. So you, you need to make a judgement based on facts. Many of our clients have busy pubs, nightclubs, restaurants, on high streets, city centres, airport locations, and they of course are very high risk premises indeed. And when we disseminate it, it enables them to get their houses in order and hopefully protect their staff and members of the public alike. The alerts are going to be coordinated by some of our best known businesses, Rolls-Royce in Derby, the next fashion chain in Leicestershire, and Boots here in Nottingham. They'll contact hundreds of other firms using emails, texts or conference calls and the police hope it's going to be a two-way process. That all helps us to build a picture. They may see things that are sus suspicious around purchasing uh, equipment, chemicals, massive mass storage facilities or even unusual travel or training or radical ideas that people may be hearing. The alerts have already been used at several major incidents in London and they'll also warn about scams and give general security advice. And Jeremy's with us in the studio. How much difference do the police think this will make? Well, the officer in charge of all this, Chris Howard, thinks it could make a huge difference, and that's because it'll get reliable information out to thousands and thousands of people. Why is that important? Well, of course, if there's a critical incident, the, the rumour mill can go into overdrive, so this is partly about reassurance, but it's also about safety advice, uh, perhaps repeating that run, hide, tell message from the police. But it might be things like whether you should evacuate an area or stay put. And where does all that information, those alerts, where does that actually come from? Well, it might come from uh, the intelligence services. It might come from the National Counterterrorism uh, Command in London. Now, what happens is the information initially goes to these 30 or so firms that are acting as coordinators. They then cascade it out within their, their own uh, business sector. Now, to give you one example, they say that includes 800 companies who are part of Nottingham Bid. So you can see just how many people they might be reaching here. That's huge, isn't it? Well, thanks very much indeed for that, Joe. We'll have more Thank on you. that on our late news as well.